better health for everybody, every day. Transforming lives, three minutes at a time. Listen up. This is your daily health tip from The Good Company. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to today's health tip. It's Melissa from The Good Company. Happy Tuesday, everybody. Fully fall here in New Jersey. I see leaves starting to change. Temperatures dropped overnight. Yesterday was definitely a winner, but I'm going to embrace the cool weather. But with the cool weather and with the fall comes uh, darker mornings, less sunlight, less exposure to sunlight on our skins. So I want you guys to think about starting a vitamin D supplementation routine. And really important to note that you need to be taking vitamin D3, and it should contain vitamin K2. Those two work synergistically. Um, Lots of great supplements on the market that contain both products. I will leave a link to the one that I love in the show notes. If you're unsure about vitamin D, it's always great to talk to your doctor. A simple blood test will show you where your vitamin D levels are. And to be honest, different doctors want your levels at different places. If you see a purely Western physician, they might think that a level of 30 is acceptable. My doctor, who's an MD, but a functional doctor, a functional medicine specialist, wants my level above a 50. And it's not that easy to get it that high. You really need to stay on your supplements. So if you have questions, please ask your doctor. Um, If you're familiar with supplements and supplementing, you might want to consider starting your vitamin D, D3 with K2 routine right about now. 